Oh my god. <laughs> So, first day, or shall I call it first night, because we're taking a night train from Bangkok to Shimpon, and we got there around 5.30 a.m. My friend's uncle picked us up, and he took us to a dim sum place, and we had breakfast there. We then came home, and she gave me a house tour, and I even got to meet her family and all her pets, and we were just like chilling, you know? Not bad. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Where came from? Should I be girl? Hello guys! Hi! Right there! Do I look like the wife that died in the yeah. beginning of the movie? Yeah. Guys! Uh, like, this is the new design of my sunglasses. With mm, the so chic. Yeah, but actually I'm gonna need you to do it for yeah. me. <laughs> Alright. Go, let's go for a ride. Alright sure, now we're heading to Champon Town. We're gonna go grab some lunch and then we're gonna go thrifting. You guys, let me tell you, this thrifting trip was a little bit of a nightmare even though like the drive and all that stuff is fun. It took us hours to find a thrifting store even though we followed the Google map, the information was not updated so we ended up having to ask a local there and finally found a place. We then spent the entire afternoon watching Love Island. It is such an awesome idea my friend came up with because we just started the whole thing together and that became the show of the trip that we watched together whenever we we're like chilling at home and all that stuff. It is our second day! You're so excited to see people! How cute is that? Hey! Oh my god! <laughs> Oh my god. No, no, no. You're getting too excited, my boy. Let's go interview the owner of the house. Hi. How, how, how do you guys feel about living here? I feel good. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. And like, how, how, how do you like um, find food over here? How, we how? don't eat. Oh, you don't eat? Are you, are you guys a ghost? Bitch. You're just a figment of your imagination, so we don't have to eat anything. You're just imagining things now. We're not even dogs. We're not even real. <laughs> We're not even here. <laughs> I'm not even here. Right? somebody like actually lives here apparently but um our tour guide say it's just like the place they come to like get the 
bird nest to go make drinks and something like that i'm not so sure so it is not like house house i think it's just like a place for them to like rest between days that they come here on the island to work yeah and surprisingly there's like no tourists here which is amazing it is just like so private and it is just the three of us
dude, like we were like so enjoying playing in the sea. Yeah, and then like for some reason, like all of us get this very annoying, painful itch. And now we can't go back into the water. And like it's so red and blah. Look at her back. Like I think that's from the thing. But this is our fan castle so far. It's a little like a heart shape, but we didn't intend to do it like that. And then we have like the main castle over here with like the I don't know what it is. It but it looks like a witch hut. And then it is surrounded by a lot of seashells. And it actually looks like you know like the Hunger Games arena and this one I found this very big coral by the like somewhere over there and then we have another I don't know what it, what it is but it is so pretty Now that this is the end of the trip, I would say that I feel so grateful that this trip happened. It has been so healing in many ways. We got to reconnect with the nature, like being in the water and all that stuff. And surprisingly, I got to connect with my friends in a deeper level. But yeah, anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you guys haven't seen our previous trip, Click on this video right here and please like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye!